right, now let's check in with Clark Benson, founder and CEO of Ranker.com, to see what fans are saying about Joker. Joker came out October 4th, and wow, have visitors to Ranker been into it. So the Joker is the number two best movie villain of all time. Who do you think's ahead? Darth Vader, of course. Now, amazingly, Joaquin Phoenix's portrayal has already jumped to the Ranker list of the best actors who've ever played the Joker. So let's see how everybody else playing this iconic role stacked up. Number two on our list of best Jokers, and sometimes number one, maybe number one as you look at this, is a no-brainer Heath Ledger from The Dark Knight. One of the things I learned from Ranker's list of fun facts about The Dark Knight is Adrian Brody, Paul Bettany, Steve Carell, and Robin Williams all expressed an interest in playing that specific role of the Joker when that movie was first announced. The number three best actor who's played the Joker is a little bit more of a surprise for many of you. Mark Hamill, Luke Skywalker himself, voiced the Joker in the wonderful, beloved by both adults and kids, Batman the Animated Series. Not surprisingly, number four is another classic, Jack Nicholson and Tim Burton's original original Batman film, and number five is the first man to play the Joker on screen, Cesar Romero from the wonderfully cheesy 60s incarnation of Batman. If you're wondering where Jared Leto's performance in the Suicide Squad movie as the Joker is on this list of the all-time best Joker performances, well, he's the opposite of a fan fave. Uh, frankly, he's been voted all the way down to number 10. He's even behind Zach Galifianakis, who played the Joker in Lego Batman. <laughs> All right, thank you, Clark. And you can head to Ranker.com to find out what else you should be watching this weekend. Thanks so much for stopping by. Hit the subscribe button to stay in the loop on the latest celebrity and entertainment news. And check out CelebrityPage.com for more Hollywood headlines.